American pop artist and cultural pioneer John Stango made a visit to the South Bronx as he showcased his latest work entitled The Heavyweight Contender. We caught up with the Philadelphia native who showed off his artistic versatility focusing on the iconic world heavyweight champ Muhammad Ali. These are my hand painted ones. Okay, this is like a progression I did. I said, well, I want to do Muhammad Ali a little different. I want to start. And when he was a little kid, and I found this, this photo, and I did this. He was 12 years old, Louisville, Kentucky. Stango metaphorically stepped into the ring for the first time, exhibiting a solo show for the Compound Gallery, found in the Mod Haven section of the Bronx, where he put his Muhammad Ali collection, along with other themed works that included sports icons, musicians, comic book heroes, and classic Americana iconography, on full display for Bronxites viewing pleasure. The Philly artist described the process for completing each new piece. It takes me about a couple days to a week to do each piece. It takes me a while. Sometimes I do like two and three pieces at a time because I get bored easy and I keep coming back like a, a busy bee back on each one. His work heralded for building upon the 1950s pop art model and helping it transition into the 21st century. Stango expressed his excitement for the progression of the art scene into its next phase, both in the Bronx and abroad. I think the Bronx is like the last frontier for development for the art scene. I think it's really... Uh, I, got, I love the vibe, the industrial vibe. The street art scene is, I believe, the new pop art. And I'm learning a lot from them. How to, how to look at things differently, how to look at my own artwork differently, how can I make it better? Founder of the Compound Gallery, Free Richardson, spoke about the commonality between visual art and hip hop culture while speaking glowingly about John Stango. Having hip hop start in the Bronx and the four cultures that's under the word hip hop, which is music, I mean, DJing, emceeing, breakdancing, and graffiti, what better place to do art in the art gallery than the Bronx? So he was one of the, like my first people I've ever seen when I wanted to start acquiring art. His name is John Stango. He's, I think he's like an offspring of an Andy Warhol. The compound will be open on Fridays and Saturdays from 12 p.m. to 5 p.m. following the opening of the heavyweight contender. And all one of one edition works by Stango will be available for purchase as well as prints and t-shirts at Compound Gallery and online at Compound's official website, thecmpd.com. Reporting for Bronxnet, Stephen Powell.